1950 proof Roosevelt dime with double die reverse. An error coin graded as PR68 by NGC. In numismatics, a double die occurs when the die used to strike a coin shows doubling of the design elements due to a misalignment during the hubbing process. This results in certain parts of the coin's design appearing doubled, in this case thin doubling is evident on reverse letterings. If you have a 1950 Roosevelt dime with a double die reverse, it can be a desirable coin for collectors, and its value may vary based on factors such as the degree of doubling, overall condition, grade, and market demand. This proof coin is well preserved, some russety patination is seen behind the neck of the president and around the northern western rims. This error coin was sold for $1,140. Number 4. 1936 Washington Quarter. Graded as PR67 Plus by NGC. According to Grading Service, the proofs of 1936 to 42 could be purchased as sets or as singles. The cost of a proof quarter dollar alone was 50 cents, plus the standard 8 cents postage. This denomination, however, proved to be the least popular of the five. Only 3,811 pieces were sold out of the estimate of 5,100 coined. Unlike the proof quarters of 1937 and later years, the 1936 edition was coined with dies taken from the same hubs used for currency coin dies. These dies were polished to give them a mirror finish, but they were identical in design details to the dies used for ordinary coinage. This proof quarter was sold for $3,609 with buyer's fee on December 3, 2023. Number 3. 1948 Roosevelt Dime with Enchanting Toning. Graded in mint state 68 full bands by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, the amazing multicolored iridescence that occupies most of the obverse and the reverse border of this sharply struck superb gem helps to create the overall aesthetic appeal that makes the piece so compelling to examine. It was sold for $4,800. Number 2. 1951 Lincoln Cent graded in mint state 67 plus red by PCGS and later confirmed by CAC. According to PCGS website, the 1951 P. Lincoln scent is very common in MS-65 condition or lower. In MS-66 it becomes much scarcer. Collectors can be picky in choosing MS-66 examples, as some coins are much nicer than others. In MS-67 condition and higher they are very scarce and command a significant premium over MS-66 examples. PCGS reports just six specimens in MS-67 plus grade with none finer. This gem ended up selling for $8,896.50. Number 1. 1926S Lincoln Cent graded in mint state 64 plus red by PCGS. This San Francisco scent offers exceptional quality and I appeal for an issue that is rarely seen with full red color. Both sides of this vivid beauty exhibit dominant pinkish rose color, the peripheries adorned with warmer reddish orange. It is sharply struck and has a satiny and smooth appearance that is suggestive of an even higher grade. Very scarce in all mint state grades. It was sold for $43,200. There you have it, folks. The fascinating journey through the world of rare US coins. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on all things numismatic, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. You can also showcase your rare coins on our website, link is shown below. Stay well. And God's will, see you in the next episode.